Hey guys, Justin from Reaction Brewing Company here. We got a nice box here we're gonna unbox. This is uh, the half horsepower uh, penguin chiller. So we'll get started. I've been waiting to uh, buy this pretty much ever since I came on. I know I recommended it to a lot of you guys after I uh, originally built my own. Uh, I'd always wish I just went with this one in the first place. And a couple of my buddies have purchased it and they really, they really liked it so far. Uh, my one wife's been using it for a couple of years now. So inside we got this box. Some, uh, some great packing right here. We'll get this guy going. I can see the chiller, we've got our bunch more packaging, all the uh, forms, just full pieces to keep the chiller in place. So some instructions, some warnings, let the chiller sit just like you have to do for your refrigerator. Uh, you have how much to put glycol in. You have some instructions for the chiller setup. For your glycol mix ratio. <clears throat> Flushing the chiller before you before you load it just to get any manufacturing debris out. It's a smart thing with anything. How to, uh, how to set up your chiller, your warranty, so that's all in there. So let's see if we can get this guy out of here. So what we have there, so we've got our, our chiller here, uh, there's a coil, all your adapter fittings here, um, through, up through the lid to hook up your tubing, so you can hook up all your tubing. 
thermal couple. Oh, there's a couple row. Nuts in here. But probably fell out of that package. There's a little, little poozy, little penguin chiller. Leave that's it for inside there, so we'll step over. Got another package here. Uh, <clears throat> so this is the accessories kit, I believe. tubing here. This is to run your, you know, run your glycol through from the chiller to your whatever unit you're hooking it up to. And this uh, this little guy, little looks like a mag drive style pump. Uh, it says three and a half gallons a minute, and then an adapter. So this is a 12 volt DC pump. So you got a 12 volt, uh, 120 volt DC adapter. You plug in, bam, runs your pump. The accessories kit comes with its own ink bird for your equipment. So you got some ink bird stuff. Just pluck that and file that over there. So you got your temp probe on your ink bird, your connections for cold and heat, and then your 120 volt connection. Lots of guys use these. I've got half a dozen, eight of those that I use on different things. All my teasers have them. Then you got your quick fittings, your quick disconnect fittings here. Um, these are nice to use so you don't have to take your fittings. So they just go together, pop that off, bam, you're done. Um, so you don't have to try to undo your clamps, take your fittings off the wall, that kind of stuff. Those are really nice. So we've got one last box here. Let's see what's in this guy. My two dollar knives are getting, are getting worn out after all this stuff this week. So it's a gallon of um, like all. So we can get started. So we got the penguin chiller style or logoed glycol here. So that'll get us started. We'll get this guy filled up. Um, we're gonna let it sit. We'll come back maybe tomorrow or the next day. We'll go through a setup video and uh, We'll get her hooked up to the system in the basement. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It's a pretty nice unit. We'll pick you up. We'll give you a little, uh, little tour inside. So you can see the coil in there. That'll be a lot more efficient than what I've been using now. Um, I'm pretty excited about it. You have your, te or your temperature set up right here. You got your set. A light, um, looks like reset, and then a back button for the menu, I assume. You got a big compressor back here. It's all metal, 
Everything's all metal, heavy duty. Big fan motor on the back. Anyways, we'll get it down in the basement. In the brewery, we'll get it set up. Um, we'll go through a setup video of how to do everything once it's refrigerants settled out in it. I don't know, I don't remember how it was sitting in the box. So, um, anyway, pretty happy with it. I've wanted one of these. I mean, the form factor is this. My other chiller's form factor takes, sits about this big by this big. Super happy to buy this. I wish it, I would have known about it when I first, uh, first bought it like all chiller. These are your best meal on the market. They're made in the United States. Um, the guy is the penguin chiller, whoever runs the Facebook has answered my questions at like 10 o'clock at night. Um, <clears throat> so, so far I've been really happy with the purchase. I've recommended them ever since I found out about them to people. Uh, like I said, two, two of my brew friends that bought them um, that I know personally, and then I've recommended them on the groups quite a bit. So, thanks for joining us guys. Super excited about this to get her hooked up and get it running. We will be back for that, and I'll see you next time.